I'm Richard Prum. I'm the William Robertson Coe Professor of Ornithology at Yale University. Today, most evolutionary biologists think that sexual selection uh, by mate choice is really a kind of natural selection. So when they see uh, the peacock's tail or a beautiful ornament in nature, they imagine that it evolves because it provides objective information about the quality of the mate that uh, the choosers need to know. However, Darwin himself uh, proposed an alternative theory, and it's one that I'm very interested in trying to bring back into the sciences. Uh, Darwin proposed that uh, mate choice is really about the aesthetic quality of the experience of the chooser. It's about what the animals themselves think of as beautiful. When Darwin wrote The Origin of Species, he had a several problems at the end. He had no theory of genetics, no elaborated theory of the origin of humans, and his real additional problem was the origin of beauty. So he worried about it for uh, more than a decade, and then came out with a brilliant second book, The Descent of Man and Selection in Relation to Sex. And in there, he proposed a second theory of evolution, a theory based on sexual selection. Immediately at the time, it was uh, rejected as impossible. People thought that animals would not have the technical capacity to evaluate different forms of ornament. And in addition, uh, it, some of the responses were explicitly misogynistic. They thought that females were specifically incapable of, of making these, these kind of choices. As a result, uh, Darwin's theory of mate choice was driven out of evolutionary biology for uh, more than a century. So one of my goals is to bring beauty back into the sciences uh, by restoring an aesthetic view of the process of evolution uh, to mainstream biology.